Hello and welcome to the QA Underground. In today's video, we're going to be talking about native mobile automation testing, specifically around the iOS platforms, using XCUI test in the Swift language. For this series, we'll be splitting these steps into four parts. The first part will be how to add XCUI test to an existing Xcode project. Part two will be related to how to create a page object model testing architecture. Part three will be around how we can improve our automation by adding accessibility identifiers to our elements. And finally, we will wrap this series up with part four, where we will use a native approach to performance testing. So for part one, we will be adding XUI tests to our existing Xcode project. The first thing we need to do is pull down our calculator sample app, which I provided a link down below, then build our project and add our test target to the project. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to do a git clone, and then I'm gonna paste in the URL for the calculator GitHub, hit enter, and pull down the repo to my local. Now I'm simply gonna go into the folder that I pulled the repo into and open the Xcode project. Now with the project open, I'm simply going to go up to product and clean build folder, and then I will go back up to product and build so I can verify that the application can build successfully. Now that I can verify that the application can build successfully, I'm going to run it to verify that it can run in the simulator. And as you can see, the calculator app does in fact boot on the simulator. So we'll stop it here. Now to add XUI tests to the project, we need to double click on the project file here. And then under targets, we will click the plus icon and then we'll scroll down to the test section and select UI testing bundle, select next. And then we will verify that our target to be tested is our app and click finish. And with that, we've now added our XUI test to the project. As you can see, it's added a calculator UI test folder and a sample XUI test. And with that, we've successfully added XUI test to our existing Xcode project. This is part one of a series of four parts. In part two of the series, we'll be walking through how to create a page object model testing architecture for the XUI test. If you are not already a subscriber to our channel but enjoy the content, I encourage you to hit that subscribe button on the way out. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you on the next video.